Hello and welcome back to our Two Point Campus Space Academy playthrough. If you haven't watched any of the previous episodes, there's going to be a card up in the top right corner of the screen. That's going to give you a link to our complete playlist. So last video we finished off year five and it's time to start year six off on the right foot. I'm hoping that we can get to our third star this year. We're getting really, really close and I think we can do it. As always, I would really appreciate if you subscribe to the channel, hit that bell so you don't miss out on any new episodes. And if you like the video, hit that thumbs up button. It really does help out the channel a lot. Let's go ahead and jump in. So let's go ahead and manage our courses here. It looks like we've got an upgrade for either astrology or cosmic expansion. And I'm thinking we go with astrology because we can get up to level six there and that'll increase our max qualification level up to seven for our staff or for our teachers, I should say. That'll allow us to get them to level seven for astrology, which will then help our students learn better. I'm noticing that we're also shy on some assistants, but I'm not finding anyone that I really like. So we're just gonna hire this person who's got the marketing skill. Maybe we can use them for something in the future. We've actually not done anything with marketing yet, but maybe we should do it now. Okay, so we're pretty close to the 1.5 million for uh, money earning money from research. We're eight out of 40 for A plus grade students. Honestly, I'm a little concerned about that. And then our campus level, we just need to upgrade three, which we can easily do in my opinion. I think that's not gonna be a challenge. We do have 18 people in the queue for training. I think we need to go ahead and expand what we've got going on here for training. I think this building is just gonna be our training building. So let's go ahead and copy what we've got. Add another training room. Now we gotta get rid of these windows here. And plop. Go ahead and get that upgrade in. Hopefully I remember to come back and get that third upgrade. Uh, Crystal, you're gonna upgrade our stuff. Oh, what? what? Oh, it, oh, right, because I placed them by the machine and thought I wanted to train them. No, I just wanted you to upgrade it. All right, what else do we need to do before we start the semester? I think we're okay. Maybe we should go ahead and get things started. Pretty challenging stuff. Check it out. I think we should build this plot because we do need to build that gym that I was talking about. We're gonna build a fantastic gym. Let's go ahead and get the construction going there. Oh, I think just popping away. Who are these people walking here? What are you go? What are you doing? Oh, you're new students. We just started the semester, right? Or not the semester, the year. Why are only two of you? Oh. Three of you, four, oh, no, they're going. Oh, they just, oh, they just jumped a little bit. Where's the door? There's the door. Uh-oh, are you stuck? Donald Hurt! Are you stuck? Nope, you're moving. Okay. Whoa, what was that? Okay, looks like we are good to go with this building. Wondering how we're going to fill this up. Obviously, we're gonna get the gym going first. Let's just fill it in in this corner here, right next to the, oh, we can't do that. 10 by six right here. We'll just put the door right in the middle. And honestly, with this build of this room, I think I'm gonna try and kind of copy what I had going on at one of my other universities at Two Point University. I've kind of got that as my almost sandbox university, even though it still is, you know, in the regular game mode. But I built this this gym that was fantastic. Same layout as this. I just really, really enjoyed how it looked. So I'm gonna try and mimic this. It's not gonna be exact. I'm not using the blueprint, but uh, go ahead and just add some some of these dumbbells. Maybe add one in a little curve. These are just for, you know, looks, for aesthetics. That's all it is. A little climbing rig. Obviously, we need our sanitation. Can we add? Can we add this here? Nope. 
other side then. And a trash bin, obviously. Go ahead and add three of them. I think that'll be enough. Got these bikes facing the wall. I would add a TV if I could, but we can't do that, unfortunately. Look at that, our research project was just completed. One more and we'll be done with that objective. Add some windows here. Two more over here, I think. I like how that looks. Go ahead and get some benches in here. How do we want to format this? Facing away or maybe like facing towards each other? Yeah, I kind of like that. You might think I sound a bit crazy, I realize that. But I really Go ahead and get a couple of these. Let's do four of them actually. I don't let's let's, let's fill that, that that middle in. And oh right, we need the the bench press. Uh let's go ahead and get rid of these two and add one more bench press there. Perfect. Oh no. Nope. Perfect. There we go. Game faked us out there. Whatever this thing is, we'll just add another one of these things. And we'll add this behind the climbing thing, just in case they fall. Obviously, we don't care about the rock wall, which is higher. We care about this tiny little climbing thing. We need the cat hanging in there, obviously. I think we need the... Oh, yeah, let's get some plants going on. Oh, that one just disappeared. Oh, well. Let's go ahead and get a picture of our university president there. And I think we might go ahead and just add some windows here to the outside, some full wall windows. And I think that's gonna do it. That's a level 12 gym. And let's go ahead and customize it a little bit. I like this white brick piling kind of thing with the red line. And I love, 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 love how the floor looks there. Making money, that's always a good thing. I'm really liking that gym. Now I'm wondering if perhaps we should remove one of our previous gyms and replace it with something else. I, I don't think we will right now. We'll just leave it as is. Let's go ahead and hire another staff member there to run our eggplant store. It's raining meteors. We might need to add a bigger library soon, too. I'm going to upgrade that lectern. I just noticed that. Uh, let's see here. Accommodation rating is not good. We need to add another dorm. And I think I'm going to use one from my blueprints here. I just got one called Nice Dorm. We're going to put it right here. And I'm going I'm to position it kind of odd at first, just because I want to have some room for a bathroom and a shower room next to it. So I'm thinking we put it right here. Uh, it's got AC. We need to remove those. And the third one is gone. Perfect. Level six dorm. I like it. It's got plenty of beds. Let's go and get these bathrooms going. So I'm going to add a very small corridor here. We're just going to do three by twos for both the bathroom and the uh, shower room. But we'll go ahead and just do three stalls here. Two sinks right next to each other and two dryers. Go ahead and get hand sanitizer dispenser there. Ooh, we can't fit a bin. That's that's unfortunate, but that's okay. Go ahead and add a poster. I want to get to level three, so let's see if we can add one more poster. Ooh, tuck it in right there. Perfect. And that is a level three bathroom. Get our shower room going. Very, very similar layout. We're not going to put sinks, though. And add towels. We just got to campus level 26. Two more levels to go. We're getting so close there. 
They had an, a window there, and I believe they get frosted, which is super, super cool. I like the, the look of that a lot. And that gets us to level three. That's our shower room. I'm liking this layout here. You might add some benches or something in that, in that corridor going to the dorm there. Looking to make new memories and serve lots of donuts. Just look in there to see if there's any staff members that are high level that'll increase our campus level significantly. Oh, look at that. We've completed our 1.5 million from research. So we are at two out of four objectives for our third star, and it is now raining down upon us from the heavens. Lots of training going on right now as well. Trying just to see what we got going on here. Can we upgrade anybody else? Can we upgrade? Can we train anybody else? Jackie, you're going to level five. Kendall, level five. Natalie, I want you to get level six. Just going through and looking for any teachers that have the upgrade ability because I want our students to get that learning bonus so that we can try and get that A+. Plus. And we've got Amber Eggnog. Okay. I think we've got plenty in the queue. We'll keep an eye on it throughout this year, but we've got plenty in there for now, I think. Everything's looking pretty good. Just kind of scanning around right now. We do have someone that's unhappy, someone that's thirsty, but you know, that's normal. They'll find their way to a vending machine, to some fun. I want to add a student union. We don't have one yet. We only have student lounges. And it's time to get a bar, to get some music going. Let's get two entrances. Get our bar going. There we go. I want to have some seating next to it. Pow, pow, pow. Let's go ahead and get a little place that our students can have some dates as well. Add two of these. Oh, this one's not wanting to drop. Oh, we're, oh, we're, oh, we're too close to the original. There we go. A two-player game. We'll add later. Get our stage there. Obviously, we need our, our dance spots there next to the stage. There's our two-player game. Uh, we can't put it in the corner there. Let's add two of them, actually. And we'll get two of these going as well. If we add a dartboard in the corner, we cannot. But we'll add a jukebox. Perfect. We need some bins because our students are absolutely messy. Can we put one right here? We cannot. How about this corner right here? Perfect. We need to add some vending machines. I'm gonna add all four right next to each other because that's what we do here. We've got a cheese ball arcade. Now this is a item that I was able to get from a bundle I got from, I think it was my Prime Gaming over on Twitch. I got a code and it came with like three assets to the game New to the so we'll go ahead and add that here we'll add some arcade machines in the middle and maybe some of these will connect the dot <laughs> connect the dot connect four eh, it should be connect three actually whatever they are we'll add those right there i like how space efficient they are just looking for anything else we can decorate with what is this? A wall TV? Interesting. We're not going to add it, though. I like what we've got in here. I want to go ahead and customize it. I like the after hours. Let's see what we got for floors. Hardwood, maple mosaic, bamboozled, 
Teak tile. Ooh, teak tile looks good. Burnt ends looks good too. Ooh. What to choose? We'll go with the teak. That is our student union completed. We need to get some more people hired to work it. This person is able to walk super fast. I like it. Training's going very well. 12 in the queue. Let's go ahead and get that upgrade going. Just doing a little bit of a pass through of campus. It looks like everything's going pretty well. Let's go ahead and get a new event going. Uh... We'll go for the party. We'll make it a month long. And we'll put it right there when classes are done mid-March. That way no one misses it because they're they're stuck in class, you know. Hey, look at this guy trying to climb up the wall. And just gave up immediately. Good job, Nermal Grotto. Interesting name there, Nermal. We have a marketing office. I completely forgot we have a marketing office. We should do something with this. Can we add a green screen to make a video? Will that fit anywhere? Doesn't look like it. Let's go ahead and remove some stuff. And then we'll just get rid of this desk. And I think that'll give us enough room for it. Yeah. Sorry, but a green screen camera and two lights does not cost $30,000. That's what I have in my setup right now. Over on my Twitch streams. Be sure to follow over there. Link down below. That's what I use. Sometimes I use a green screen. Sometimes I don't. Lately, I've not been using it. Let's go ahead and upgrade that green screen. Another $10,000. Perfect. Ooh. Look at all that knowledge going to their head. Shocking. Oh, what? Uh, uh, what's going on here? You okay, bud? Oh, God. Doing the hygiene dance. Frederick! Oh, run! Run! Oh, and... Oh, they were late for class. They were late for class. You hate to see it. At least Frederick's got an A+. And it's filthy. To myself, for myself. Oh dear. Now that would be pretty excellent. We're missing a teacher here. What's that all about? Can we hire some more people? Anybody with the tutoring ability? No. Go ahead and get rid of all of these. See if we can get some new applicants that have the tutoring ability. Ludwig, welcome to the team. Simon, welcome to the team. You are just going to be a cleaning person. I just realized the janitor's helmets are different colors. Some of them are white, some of them are yellow. I guess that would be dependent upon their title. I know that like a white helmet typically means like a supervisor, like a higher role. That's very interesting. Very, very, very cool. Doing a little bit of a, a once over on the campus right now. Just looking for any problems. Just scanning around. Everything's looking pretty okay. 123 members for the Power Nap Club right now. We do have another club, but it's just not doing as well. Look at the party! Oh, that's a long line for drinks. What are the drinks? Oh my gosh, that looks absolutely delicious. And that sound was so nice. Let's listen again.
Oh, I don't know why that sound is very satisfying. It's just like immediately like a root beer float. Well, that's a different one. That's like a smoothie almost. Very cool. We might need to see about adding another bar soon. Oh, look at that dance. Oh, yeah. You got it. Look at you go. I'm going to leave you to it. Eight people in the queue for training. Let's go ahead and get some more teachers. I'm going to get you to level five. Any other teachers? Gonna get you to level six. Woo. Level five for Violet there. Level four, Reginald. Who else we got on the list here? I think that might be everyone. Yeah, we'll go ahead and leave that for now. I really like that park. This looks so nice. The mayor is coming to visit. Okay, thank you for letting me know. I'm gonna go ahead and take a look here. You want Jasmine Odyssey? Yeah, let's go ahead and get Jasmine here to play some music. Maybe at the end of the year. Um, actually, we'll just do it right here. Alf has completed training in Astrology 2. Excellent. We don't have teachers in either of our tutoring right now. That's a concern. But first, we're going to plop this down because we've got plenty of these. I can't put it there. Put it right there. Got a third one here. Let me put it in the park. Eh. Yeah, kind of crowd it. But outside the training building. That sounds great. Lost money that month. Interesting. I've got time acceleration on right now because I think we're going to get to campus level 28 very soon. And I'm really anxious to see how many A plus grade students graduate this year. While we're at it, let's go ahead and add a smoothie machine here. I <laughs> mean, smoothie machine, smoothie kiosk. Oh, we don't have any room. Let's move this statue here. And what? what is this? A winter kiosk? Absolutely, I want that. Let's plop that down right now. What does it even sell? I don't even know. I just want it. Now let's put the smoothie kiosk right next to it as well. I'm wondering if it's a good idea to have all of these kiosks right next to each other or if I should like space them out around campus. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Because I kind of just see it as like a food court kind of thing. But then I also know that, you know, in like cities and stuff, you've got just, you know, a one food cart at one spot and then another block away you have a different one, that kind of thing. Ooh, the smoothies are a big hit. Level 28 campus. That means we have three out of the four objectives completed for our third star. We just need 32 students to graduate with an A+. I'm really hoping we can get it by the end of the year. You want to watch a sci-fi movie? Absolutely, let's do it. We have one more month this year gonna continue with time acceleration because I just want to see us get this third star. I'm really hoping we can do it. Just gonna let things roll out. 
I'm gonna hire some more staff as well. Why not? I'm trying to click, click. There we go. I just don't want you to work in the library because you're not qualified for it. Let's upgrade that green screen to level three. Half of the month is left. Oh, we're getting so close. Let's do some more training here. Alf, I want you to be level four. Jackie, you're going to level six. I think we got everything there. Time accelerate some more. Mabel has completed training in aerodynamics one. Good job, Mabel. Waiting around at this point. Tick tock, tick tock. We're so close. Did we do it? No, we didn't. We're at 25 out of 40. Let's go ahead and see how we did this year though with our awards. Year six, 100% pass rate. Graduating 54, continuing 94, 86% average exam results. We're the queen of clubs. We've got two clubs now. Students, 93. Power nap is still the most popular. Pat, completing up to level five. Good job, Pat. Campus of the year. That's going to us. 100% pass rate. Folks, thank you so much for watching this episode. We're going to be coming back with the next one. And I think we're going to actually get our third star in the next episode. I think we're so close. We just have, what, 15 students left. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already subscribed, hit that subscribe button. Hit the thumbs up button if you liked the video. If you want to watch us do some live streams, I stream over on Twitch. Link is down below. Thank you, as always, for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.